We really feel like we're at the forefront of data center operation. Meta owns and operates huge data centers all over the globe, and we've invested a lot of time and effort into optimizing the operation of those data centers. In particular, Meta is at the forefront of physical automation of these data centers with things like robotics and automated processes. As we scale our data centers to meet the rapidly increasing demands posed by our user growth and new applications such as AI, we need to be smart about how we best utilize our most important asset, which is our people. We've been working on innovative ideas to bring automation to the physical world in the data centers. By automating work that might be repetitive or dangerous, such as moving heavy racks around the facility, we can ensure that our people are able to focus on the most important operational tasks. This has always been the intersection of you know, leaders in their industries coming together to, to look at an application and go, yeah, we need, we need to completely think about this differently. We're not doing fulfillment with our robotics at Meta. We're using them to improve productivity, safety, accuracy, and a data center floor. So that's a new, new application. Rack volume is a huge challenge. And by adding Tug V3, we're able to tackle moves, receiving, decom simultaneously. We have a lot of space and a lot of ground to cover when we're moving materials from one corner of the building to another. By maximizing the mechanical capacity on, on an AGV was pretty critical for us. Between Tug V3 and the Asset Scan robot, it exposes the team more and more to robotics, which is a win because that's just the direction we're going. These are not AGVs in the traditional sense. Uh, these AGVs have LiDAR and they contain a map of the facility and they actually plan their own routes and, and then they navigate and do their own localization using LiDAR sensors. We actually extract from the CAD of the data center what the map should look like from a robot's point of view and we actually just build the map through software and then we can push it to the robots. Because that's all automated, anytime like racks are shuffled around, uh, the system will just generate a new map and then send it to the robot so we don't have to like manually run SLAM and cartography algorithms. With things like the asset scan robot, as they become more detailed, they can get a higher level of scanning done and provide us better assurances, our SOX compliance, our inventory accuracy. There's some parts of the logistic world that use robots to deliver parts. I see us potentially getting there down the road. Physical automation, I think, will continue to remain central to data center operations, especially with the focus on sustainability and energy efficiency. We believe that the innovations that we're able to drive should be shared with the industry. So in some ways, it's no different than when we originally started Open Compute and shared the entire data center design of our prime bill data center. We did it with our hardware, and now we're going to do it with our robotics. We firmly believe that sharing this work with the industry will expand the pool of people who can utilize, test, and further build upon our work, which will result in even more innovation and improvement. Open sourcing our products and designs gives them a better chance of becoming the industry standard, which in turn makes them more widely deployed and easier to improve and support. We end up with better security and robustness when anyone is allowed to examine and stress test these innovations. And all of this aligns well with Meta's core values of being open and building